অনাদি করম ফলে অনাদি করম ফলে পরি ভবার নব জলে তরি বারে না দেখি উপার দিস ইজ এ সং সং বাই ভক্তিবিন ঠাকুর ডিপিক্টিং দি পিকচার অব দি কন্ডিশন শো ইট ইজ সেড হিয়ার ভক্তিবিনাথ ঠাকুর ইজ স্পিকিং টেকিং হিমসেল্ফ অ্যাজ ওয়ান অফ দি অর্ডিনারি হিউম্যান বিং দ্যা ডিউ টু মাই পাস্ট ক্রিয়েটিভ অ্যাক্টিভিটিজ I have now fallen in this ocean of new science and I do not find any means of coming out of this great ocean. It is just like the ocean of poison. A bishaya hala hale, dibanishi hiya jale. Uh, as if anyone takes some pungent food and uh, it burns the heart similarly as we are trying to be happy by sense enjoyment uh, it, actually it is just becoming the opposite a cause of burning our heart e bishaya hala hale dibanishi hiya jale that burning sensation is going on 24 hours day and night mono ko bhu sukha nahi pae and on account of this my mind is not at all in satisfaction asha paso sato sato klesho dai obirod i am always making plan hundreds and thousand uh, how i shall become happy Uh, but actually all of them giving me trouble uh, pains 24 hours prabitti urmiro tahe khala it is exactly like the waves of the ocean always dashing one another that is my position kaam krodho adi chhoy bat pare dai bhoy besides that there are so many thieves and rogues uh, especially they are six in number namely lust anger and me uh, illusion and so many ways they are always present and i am afraid of them aboshan hoilo ashi bela in this way my life is becoming uh, advance or i am coming to the point of end gyano karma thago dui more pratari laloi although this is my position still two kinds of activities namely mental speculation and fruitive activities they are cheating me gyano karma thago thago means cheater uh, there are জ্ঞান কর্ম ঠগ দুই মরে প্রতারিয়া লই দে আর মিসলিডিং মে অ্যান্ড অবশেষে ফেলে সিন্ধু জল আফটার মিসলিডিং মে দে ব্রিং মে অন দি সি শো অ্যান্ড পুসেস মে ডাউন উইদ ইন দি সি এহানো সময় বন্ধু তুমি কৃষ্ণ কৃপাস আন্ডার দি সাকমস্টান্স মাই ডিয়ার কৃষ্ণ you are the only friend tumi krishna kripa sindhu kripa kori tolo more bole now i have no strength to get out of this ocean of new science so i request i pray unto your lotus feet that by your strength you kindly pick me up potito king kore dhori pada padma dhuli kori after all i am your eternal servant so some or other i am fallen in this ocean you kindly uh, pick me up and fix me as one of the dust of your lotus feet deho bhakti vinoda asra bhakti thaku uh, in seeds that will kindly give me shelter on your lotus feet ami tabo nitya das 
actually I'm your eternal servant. Bhuliya maya pas. Somehow or other I forgot you and I am now fallen in the network of maya. Bhattvaya achi daya maya. My dear Lord, I have been entangled in this way. Kindly save me. Pandi Ham Sri Guru Sri Juta Padakamalam Sri Guran Vaisnava Sri Rupam Sagrajatam Sahagan Raghunathanitam Tvam Sajeevam Sahadaitam Sāvadhūtaṁ Parijana-sahitaṁ Krishna-caitaṁ-devaṁ Sri Radha Krishna Padaṁ Sahagana Nalita Sri Vishaka Nitaamsha Namam Vishnu Padaya Krishna Prashtaya Bhutali Sri Mate Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Ji Namini Sri Var Sabhanavi Devi Daitaya Kripabhaye Krishna Samanna Vijnana Dhanyi Prabhavi Namaha Madhu Jayujjala Pramadhyā Sri Rupānu Ga Bhakti Ga Sri Gaura Karuna Shakti Vigrahaya Namastute Namaste Gaura Vani Sri Muttaye Dinatarini Rupanu Gaviru Japa Siddhanta Dantaharini Nama Gaura Kishanaya Sakshada Vairagga Mutraya Vipra Lammara Shambodhi Padam Bhojaya Te Namaha Nama Bhakti Vinadaya Satchidananda Namine Gaura Chakti Sarupaya Rupanuga Marayati Nama Bhakti Vinadaya 
ते गोपेश गोपी का कंत राधा कंत नम सुते जयता सुरत पंग ममो मंदन मते गति मत्सर्वर्ष पदा भोज राधा मदन मोहन दिव्यारण्यकद्रमाध श्रीमदरत्नागार सिंह सनस्थ श्री राधा श्रील गोविंद देव प्रश्वाली भी से मानो बना श्रीमान रासर सारंभी वंशी बट तट सीता कर्षण वेणु सन गोपी गोपीनाथ से संसार दाबा नललील लोक प्राणाय कारुण्य घना घन प्राप्त कल्याण गुणारणवश्य वंदे गुरासी शरणारविंद महाप्रभो की चरणी कविता मनसोरसेन पशु तरंग भाजो वंदे गुण श्री चरणारविंद वंदे गुण श्री चरणारविंद वंदे गुण श्री चरणारविंद 
अत्यंत गौराधा शिवाषदी गौर्भक्त भिन्ना जथे कृष्ण चैतन्न प्रभो नितादाधाशदे गौरभक्त हरे राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे Hare 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 Rama Hare 
परमहंस परिव्राज कचाज सतन सतस्मा भक्ति धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी प्रवादी जय अनंत कोटि वशन बिंद की जय नामाचार्य शील हरिदास ठाकुर की जय प्रेम से कहो श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु नित्यानंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधार शिवाषादि गौर भक्त बिंद की जय श्री श्री राधा कृष्ण गोपनाथ श्याम कुंड राधा कुंड गिरी गोवर्धन की जय नाम धाम की जय नवदी धाम की जय गंगा माई की जय जमुना माई की जय स्वामी तो भक्त बिंद की जय श्री श्री भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी महाराज की तिरोभाव तिथि महामस की जय श्री श्री भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी महाराज की तिरोभा तिथि महामहस की जय श्री श्री भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी महाराज की तिरुभा तिथि महामहोत्सव की जय थैंक यू वेरी मच हरे कृष्ण आई वॉज थिंकिंग वेरी जय आनंद ना इमीजिएटली यस कम गुरु महाराज थैंक यू वेरी मच टेक केयर इट मे नॉट फॉल सो टुडे इज द डिसअपियरेंस डे ऑफ माय गुरु महाराज एज आई टोल्ड यू दैट साधव जीव बा मरो बा देर वॉज ए नाइस स्टोरी दी आर दैट डे आई टोल्ड यू दैट सेज इज गिविंग डिफरेंट काइंड्स ऑफ ब्लेसिंग्स टू डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ पर्सन्स सो टू ए किंग सन ए प्रिंस ही ब्लेसेड राजपुत्र चिरंग जीव Oh, you are king, son, prince. You live forever. And Muni Putra, the son of a saintly person, he blessed him. Majiva, majiva. You don't live. Raj Putra, Chirang Jiva, Muni Putra, majiva. And Shadhu, devotees. He blessed him, Jeevo ba Amaro ba. Either you live or you die, as you like. And there was a butcher. He blessed him, Ma Jeevo Ma Amaro. You don't die, don't live. So these words are very significant. That I have already explained. Still, I am explaining. The prince. He is enjoying sense. That's all. He has got enough facility for sense enjoyment. So his next life is hellish, because if you indulge in sex life, then Krishna will give you facility to have sex life three times in an hour, just like the pigeons. The monkeys, the sparrows, they are very sexually strong. You have seen it. So the facility is given. So princely order, they are after sense enjoyment. So he is blessed that better you live forever because after your death, you do not know what is going to happen to you. You are going to. Get a healthy life. Better you live for some time. Go on with your enjoyment. And Muni Putra, Ma Jiva, 
brahmachari working under the guidance under strict disciplinary guidance of his spiritual master he is blessed majiva the you better die because you are so trained to enter into the kingdom of god so i should you take so much trouble better you die and go back to god majiva and a devotee he blessed jivo va marova my dear devotee either you live or die the same thing. and the butcher he blessed him majiva mamara you don't live don't die what is to do his living condition is so abominable from the morning he has to slaughter so many animals see the blood stain the grass the seen that is his livelihood so what a horrible life this is so don't leave and don't die also because after death oh he is going to be in so much hellish condition nobody can describe so both life living condition and death after death his condition is very horrible anyway apart from others the devotee for him appearance and disappearance the same thing just like when my spiritual master appeared at jagannath puri he was the son of a very big and uh, government office bhakti vinod thakur he was magistrate government office and in those days a magistrate is a big officer in the government practically next to governor and bhakti vinod thakur was in charge of the jagannath temple that is the system in jagannath puri and the manager in charge of the temple is the district magistrate so there was ratha yatra festival and the car was passing in front of bhaktimino thakur's house bhaktimino thakur's name was kedarnath dotta when he was magistrate he was known as uh, king dot kedarnath the the car stopped before his house and at that time sila bhakti siddhanta saraswati thakur a child in the lap of his mother the mother took the opportunity of rising on the car he was magistrate's wife so he had the facility immediately people gave her a way to go in on on the top of the car and place the child on the lotus feet of jagannath and there were many garlands one garland fell upon him bhakti siddhant sir the blessings this was one of the there are so many other things uh, when he was a child 2 3 years old he ate one mango fruit which was kept for uh, offering to the deity so his father mildly rebuked him oh you have done very wrong thing it was meant for deity and you have taken it oh you should not have done it the child was 2 or 3 years old he took it so seriously the never after that he took mango whenever we offered him mango he said no i am offended i cannot take mango he was thinking that that you see never in his life he took a mango he was thinking that i offended in my childhood by taking the mango of the deity but this is the characteristic of acharya 
they teach by their life action that one should be so much determined that one should not be a child took the mango, there is no offense, but he took that vow. Another instance, in my presence, at that time we are also young men, and one of my god brothers, his name is Dr. Aud Bihari Kapoor. Uh, he is now retired in Vrindavan. Uh, last time I saw him. He was also a young man, and his wife was also young. So we were sitting together talking with Guru Maharaj, and the girl proposed, My dear Master, I want to speak with you. So Guru Maharaj said, Yes, you can talk whatever you like. So she said, I want to talk with you secretly, not in the presence of everyone. The Guru Maharaj said, No, I cannot talk with you secretly. You can talk in the presence of my all other disciples. So even that girl was just like his granddaughter by age calculation, he refused to talk with a young woman in a secret place. These are the uh, instances. Uh, so in his life he was Akhanda Brahmachari. Bhaktivinoda Thakur had many other sons and he was the uh, fifth son. And and some of his other brothers also, they did not marry, and my Guru Maharaj, he also did not marry. From the childhood, he is strict Brahmacharya. Bhakti Siddhant Saraswati Goswami Maharaj, and he underwent a very severe penances for starting this movement worldwide movement. That was his mission. Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to do this. He, 1896, Bhaktivinoda Thakur wanted to introduce this Krishna Consciousness movement by sending his, uh, this book, uh, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, His Life and Precepts. Fortunately, that year was uh, my birth here, and by Krishna's arrangement we came in contact. I was born in a different family. My Guru Maharaj was born in a different family. Who knew that I will come to His protection? Who knew that I would come in America? Who knew that you American boys will come to Me? These are all Krishna's arrangement. We cannot understand how things are taking place. In 1936, today is 9th December 1938, that means 32 years ago, in Bombay I was then doing some business. All of a certain, perhaps on this date, sometimes between 9 or 10 December, at that time Guru Maharaj was indisposed, little, and he was staying at Jagannath Puri on the seashore. So I wrote him later, My dear Master, your other disciples, brahmachari, sannyasi, they are rendering you direct service, and I am a householder. I cannot live with you. I cannot serve you nicely. So I do not know how can I serve. Simply an idea. I was thinking of serving him. How can I serve him seriously? So 
The reply was dated 13 December 1936. In that letter he wrote, My dear such and such, I am very glad to receive your letter. I think you should try to push our movement in English. That was his writing. And that will go to you and to the people who will help you. And I wish that was his instruction. And then in 1936, on the 31st December, that means just after writing this letter, a fortnight before his departure, uh, he passed away. But I took that order of my spiritual master very seriously. But I did not think that I'll have to do such and such thing. I was at that time a householder. But this is the arrangement of Krishna. If we strictly try to serve a spiritual master, his order, then Krishna will give us all facilities. That is the secret. Although there was no possibility, I never thought, but I took it little seriously by studying a commentary by Vishnu Chakravati Thakur on the Bhagavad Gita. In the Bhagavad Gita, the verse, Bhagavad-śādmika-buddhi rekiha kurunandana. In connection with that verse, Vishnu Chakravati Thakur gives his commentary that we should take up the words from the spiritual master as our life and soul. We should try to carry out the instruction the specific instruction of the spiritual master very rigidly, without caring for our personal benefit or loss. So I tried a little bit in that spirit. So he has given me all facilities to serve him. Things have come to this stage that in this old age I have come to your country, and you are also taking this movement seriously, trying to understand it. We have got some books now, so there is little uh, foothold of this movement. Now on this occasion of my spiritual master's departure, as I am trying to execute His will. Similarly, I shall also request you to execute the same order through my will. I am an old man. I can also pass away at any moment. Uh, that is nature's law. Nobody can check it. So that is not very astonishing. But my appeal to you on this auspicious day of uh, the departure of my Guru Maharaj, that at least to some extent you have understood the essence of Krishna consciousness movement, you should try to push it on. People are suffering for want of this consciousness. As we daily pray about devotees, Bancha kalpatarubhascha kripa sindu bhaivacha patitanam pavani bhyo vaishnavi bhyo namo namo. A Vaishnav, a devotee of Lord, his life is dedicated for the benefit of the people. You know, most of you belong to Christian community. How Lord Jesus Christ, He says that 
for your sinful activities, he has sacrificed himself. That is the determination of devotee of the Lord. They don't care for personal comforts because they love Krishna or God. Therefore they love all living entities because all living entities are in relationship with Krishna. So uh, similarly you should learn this Krishna consciousness movement means to become Vaishnava and feel for the suffering humanity. But to feel for the suffering humanity there are different angles of vision. Somebody is thinking of the suffering of the humanity from bodily conception of life. Somebody is trying to open a hospital to give a relief to the diseased condition. Somebody is trying to distribute food stuff in poverty stricken countries or places. These things are certainly very nice. But actual suffering of the humanity is due to lack of Krishna consciousness. These bodily sufferings, they are temporary, neither they can be checked by the laws of nature. Suppose if you give some distribution of food stock in some poverty-stricken country, that does not mean that this health makes solution of the whole problem. The real beneficial work is to invoke every person to Krishna consciousness. As soon as he comes to Krishna consciousness, the same example as I have given several times, that a rich man's son is loitering in the street forgetting his father's opulence and property. And somebody out of sympathy giving him some food. But other person comes to him and says, Oh, my dear boy, I know you, you are the son of such and such rich man. Why you are loitering in the street? Come on, I shall take you to your father. So he, that gentleman, takes that loitering boy to his father. The father is glad and the boy inherits his father's property and his whole problem of life becomes solved. This is a crude example. Similarly, all living entities, they are loitering within this universe in different bodies, in different planets, and from time immemorial without knowing that he belongs to the kingdom of God. He is the direct son of Krishna and God. If Krishna is the proprietor of everything and he can enjoy his father's property and these uh, problems of material condition life automatically solved. Just like if you become a rich man, if you can possess uh, millions of dollars, then your poverty is automatically solved. Similarly, if you become Krishna conscious, if you act in that way, then all other problems in the material condition of life solve. So this is such a nice Moment, Ahantang Sarvapapibha Mukha Shami Mahasucha. The Bhagavad Gita says, the Lord says, people's sufferings are due to his sinful activities. Ignorance. Ignorance is the cause of sinful activity. Just like a man does not know. Suppose a foreigner like me comes in America. And he does not know, because in India, just like 
in your country the card is driven from the right side. In India, I have seen in London also, the car is driven from the left side. So suppose he, he does not know, he drives the car on the left side and incurs some accident and he is taken by the police custody and if he says, Sir, I did not know that here the car is driven from the right side. That does not make him excused. The law will punish him. So ignorance is the cause of breaking the law or sinful activities. And as soon as you commit some sinful activity, you have to suffer the result. So the whole world is in ignorance, and due to ignorance, is complicated in so many actions and reactions, either good or bad. There is nothing good within this material world, everything is bad. So we have manufactured something good and something bad. Here, because in the Bhagavad Gita we understand this place is dukkhalam asasat. This place is for misery. So how you can say, in miserable condition, how you can say that this is good or this is bad? Everything is bad. So those who, those persons who do not know the material condition and die, they manufacture something, this is good, this is bad, because they do not know everything here is bad, nothing good. Uh, one should be very mis pessimistic of this material world, then he can make advance in spiritual life. Dukkhālam asās. This place is full of miseries, and if you study analytically, you will find simply miserable condition. Therefore the whole problem is that we should give up our material condition and life, and in Krishna consciousness, we should try to elevate ourselves to the spiritual platform and thereby be promoted to the kingdom of Godhead. Jadgatyana nivartanti tadhyamam paramam mama. Where going, nobody comes back to this miserable world, and that is the supreme abode of the Lord. So there are description in the Bhagavad Gita. So this Krishna consciousness movement is authorized, very important. Now you American boys and girls who have taken uh, to this movement, please take it more seriously. And that is the mission of Lord Chaitanya and my Guru Maharaj, and we are also trying to execute the will by disciplic succession. You have come forward to help me. I shall request you all that I shall go away, but you shall leave. Don't give up pushing on this moment, and you will be blessed by Lord Chaitanya and His Divine Grace, Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada. Thank you very much.
Bishaya Chariya Kabe Kabe Hama Pera Kabe Tri Bishaya Chariya Rang 
বলিতে হবে ভোলা কচারি হরি হরি বলিতে না ভাবে গৌরাঙ্গ বলিতে হবে ভোলা কচারি হরি হরি বলিতে না আর কবে নিতাই করুণা করিবে সংসার বাসনাময় কবে তুচ্ছ হবে আর কবে নিতাই চং আর কবে নিতাই করুণা করিবে সংসার বাসনা মবে তুচ্ছ হবে বিষয় ছাড়ি কবে বিষয় ছাড়ি কবে শুদ্ধ হবে মবে হামের রঘুনাথ পদে খুতে কবে হম বুঝ বসে যুগল পীড়িতে রূপ রঘুনাথ পদে হুতে কবে হম বুঝ বসে যুগল পীড়িতে বিষয় ছাড়ি কবে বিষয় ছাড়ি কবে শুদ্ধ হবে মনে তবে আমার বুঝবছে গাল পীড়িতে হরি হরি বলিতে না বে গৌরাঙ্গ বলিতে হবে আর কবে নিতাই চ 
करुणा करीबे संसार बचना मैं कबे तुझे हो बे आर कबे नीताई चनं करुणा करीबे संसार बचना मैं कबे तुझे हो बे Bichaya chadi Lakasari Hari Hari Bolitena Yane Babini Gauranga Balite Habik 